Avex against BTC. We are, yeah, we are continuing higher for Avex against BTC. Yes, we are above the skinny pink line. Uh, yeah, this is some some sort of a falling channel, something like sheep, uh, but this is a smaller one. So Avex could still break out higher, right? I just I just don't feel convinced again with this move uh, by Avex against BTC. Uh, there could still be another wave down, right? ABC. Yeah, there could be four and a five. There could be five waves down, right? Because when things move impulsively towards the upside, they move in waves of five. When things are correcting, usually it's three. Sometimes you can get five as well. So this could be a five wave move towards the downside. The thing is, we're not exactly sure. We don't see any clear signs of a proper bullish reversal yet. I mean, of course, if we break the resistance, great. Uh, then hopefully we could get some sort of a consolidation, consolidation, consolidation and we could jump in for a trade for sheep as it breaks out right uh, of the consolidation but if you don't get the consolidation and we just keep going higher and higher then yeah it's just too bad if you don't see any clear proper tradable chart pattern because we are traders and we are risk averse avex against usdt um, yeah avex usdt isn't again not exactly that's convincing uh, i don't see any clear signs of a proper bullish reversal there's no bullish reversal this is not a bullish reversal chart pattern uh, the risk again is still there that we could still pop lower and if you do keep crawling up that's not good we want to see uh, very high volatile moves towards the upside not slow volatile moves because we could be completing a mountain range completing a descending triangle and we pop much lower for avex that would be brutal actually so yeah be careful be very very careful about going to a trade too soon for AVEX.